Maintaining your F1 status during CPT is a little different than it is during a regular semester. Let's look at a few important points together. First, be sure to stay enrolled and complete all requirements for your internship course. If you're doing part-time CPT, be sure to maintain full-time enrollment as well. Next, be careful that you only work during your authorized CPT time and for the authorized employer. You are not authorized for CPT until you have your new I-20 with the CPT authorization on page two. Doing practical training without authorization is a violation of your F1 status. If you think you may have to change employers or stop your internship early, speak to one of OIE's international advisors right away before making any changes. It is not always possible to change employers during CPT. Finally, if you decide to travel outside of the U.S., that's okay. Just make sure you have the following items when you re-enter the U.S. after your trip. A valid travel signature, a passport that's valid for at least six months, F1 visa that's valid on the day that you re-enter the U.S., and proof of your enrollment at UT Arlington.